All right, guys, so today I'm going to be showing you this really cool um, optical illusion involving these $20 bills. As you can see, they're just folded up into quarters. And all I'm going to have to do here is slide these in between each other. So let's say if I stick the first 20, and this is going to go right in the middle between the other one. And let's say you put this here. It's going to slide right in just like this. And then at this point, what I'm going to try to do is show you guys that I cannot uh, remove this, remove these 20s because they're both intersecting each other. So essentially, what I have to do is just apply enough pressure to the 120 on top. This is going to allow me to slide that through the other dollar bill, essentially melting it, it through. So this is a trick, guys, and if you want to do it, don't forget to stick around for the tutorial. All right, so the best part about this trick is that it doesn't require any gimmicks, so you can do this with uh, actually two $20 bills, two uh, bills of different denominations, doesn't really matter. Uh, the whole thing is you just need two uh, bills. So the first thing you want to do is the, the trick is entirely based on the folding of one of the bills. So this is going to be one of the bills that you have uh, before you go up to the spectator, and then you can take a bill from them. So uh, you want to go up, you want to have this bill handy, and you just kind of have this off to the side or just kind of holding it, and you tell the spectator if you can if you can borrow a bill, and you tell them to fold it into quarters so it doesn't really matter how they fold it they just basically you fold it long ways so here's the bill flat you take it and you fold it in half hot dog style and then you fold it in half hamburger style just like that so you're going to be left with this fraction of a bill so then at this point you're going to take the bill back and you can also kind of fold it over once the once they give it back to you you can kind of fold it like this this way it's kind of a little bit it's not perfectly aligned but it's a little bit open so they can see in between here and now what you're going to be doing is uh, when I was performing the trick I kind of had to put the dollar bill in without you guys seeing it from this angle but when you're performing it to the spectator you're going to be holding it so this is what they see so they're going to be pointing that way and you also kind of hold the dollar bill like this off to the right a little bit so that way you're kind of covering up these creases and I'll show you guys how to do that but I'm just going to be giving you the exposed view here so essentially what's going on is the bill is going to be put in this part of the crease so basically I'll show you guys how to do that but essentially it's gonna look like this and when the bill comes through you're sliding it through like that covering it up this is kind of the exposed view of what's going on and I'll show you guys how to fold it so what you want to do is take a regular bill just like this and you fold it the exact same way so you're gonna be folding it into quarters so you do hot dog style you fold it into another quarter so the same way you folded the other bill and then what you want to do is as you can see there's this little this little circle thing right there all you want to do is fold the first flap of the bill here you fold that so it touches the middle so now this is what you have within the bill so you have it folded in the quarters you take the first flap you fold that over and then what you do is you fold it back but not the whole thing just about two-thirds of that's going to go back like this so this is going to be the fold that you want. As you can see, this is what it should look like at the very end. Okay, and then at this point, as you can see, these these don't really line up. As you can see, this kind of overhangs in the back. So what you want to do is just kind of bring that fold, the top fold up here. You bring that up so that way it lines up with the bottom. You redo that crease, and now you are left with this right here. So then at this point, you're going to be holding it, pinching it from this angle, holding it towards the spectators. And then from here, you're going to take the dollar bill that they folded in half, and you're going to be sticking this edge right here, this part. That's just going to go right in this crease. So you can see it's going to go in this crease just like that. I'm trying to hold it at a different angle so you guys can see that. You're putting it right in there. And then when this is all closed up, you're holding it like this, and this dollar bill flap is going to cover that crease just like this. And this is how you'd hold it to the spectator. So this is towards them. You're holding the whole thing front and back. And you're acting like you're putting it in between, but in reality, you're just putting it in here. Cover that up. You fold it. And this is going to be the setup. And now you can show this to the spectators. You can push this down a little bit, but as you can see, you don't want to flash this open quarter or this open edge. So you kind of push this dollar bill to cover that flap the entire time. And this is probably the best visual that you're going to be able to give the spectator at this point. And then from here, you can show them, you can grab your the two tops here and kind of just mess around with it a little bit, showing them that it's going to be impossible for you to separate these 
these dollar bills, and then what you do is you place your thumb at the bottom, at the corner of here, and essentially you're just sliding it up this crease. But your thumb is going to be covering that the entire time, so you put your thumb here. You can leave these bills separated so they can see the whole thing happening. You're just going to wiggle your thumb around, make sure it's covering up the crease, and once you can feel that you've, that you've gotten to this point where this corner right here is now not overlapping this corner, you're covering the entire thing up, pushing that along the curve, just like that. And this is what's going to be going on. And you can just push it completely out. That's going to uh, release. And you're going to be left with this crease right here. And what I did in the performance was I just turned the, uh, the dollar bill away. But what you can do is you can just use your thumb here, cover it up. And then while the spectator is opening up this bill, you can just casually open up the bill from the back stretch this out and reveal it to them as well. So this is a trick guys, I hope you guys like it, and um, as always, thanks for watching.